fucking no, embarrassing. It's not, it's not about respect for Fulham. It's all about no attacking mentality at all. We no. have literally got nothing going forward. We go out. We have nothing. Our old game plan was to stop them scoring. Yeah, and it's, and a, and it's the biggest game of our year. Yeah, and we are as, worrying about them. Yeah, as soon as we conceded, yeah, even after that, we were still trying to play. Do you know what? Like, I've been looking forward to this for weeks and weeks. No. And spent so much money, and they didn't even try. You know, like it just looked to me like we tried to stop them, not tried to win, just tried yeah. to stop Fulham. Fuck off, Fulham is shit. Who they got? Two. All right, I'll, I'll even give you Mitrovic. So you got two players now, and they're still shit. Look, I mean, if you break it down. Top four this season. All right, Wolves deserve to go top. Fair yeah, enough. Wolves are quality, yeah. mate. They don't deserve to go top because they're quality this year. Because purely because they're not fucking. They're quality football. They deserve yeah. it. Yeah, Wolves deserve to go up. Cardiff. 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 Sorry, Cardiff. bro. Cardiff. Don't want to interrupt you. Cardiff. Cardiff started the season with 12 points. Yeah, they started the season with 12 points. Don't want to interrupt you. Cardiff started the season with 12 full-time professional players. Cardiff. They weren't. They didn't even have a squad, and they've gone up. It's We've fucking spent fucking 30, yeah, 40 yeah, million. Cardiff don't. Cardiff don't. Warnock has done nil, right? exactly what Mourinho has done with Man, Man U. What he budget? He just rotted them until the top. Yeah, but what rotted. budget did he have though? Fuck all. But the thing is, like, all I bet he's Warnock played, spent ten million. Nah, all he's done is played defensive. Ten million, you reckon? Football. Not even that. Not even that. Yeah, We've yeah. spent dope. I mean, he's paying wages and wages and wages, and we can't beat Warnock Cardiff. We're Aston fucking Villa. It's a disgrace, mate. Nah, you know it's a disgrace. Is, you know, you know the mentality thing is, like, is heartbreaking now. This is it. This is it for us now. We've had two seasons down in the championship. This is our last season. We get the, the parachute payments. You get forty. You get forty million. We're going to end up being a Leeds. We are. You get forty million. Forty million a year. Yeah, yeah. Million a year it's after heartbreaking. The first two heartbreaking, mate. We've had our last parachute Bro, payments. Bro, you're a villain, boy. I can see by the badges. Is this fucking heartbreaking or what? We played against Fulham and we're respecting Fulham. We're Aston fucking Villa football club. Breaking my heart, mate. It's breaking no my heart. Like that. None of the Villa boys think like no, that. No, we're not respecting. They don't them. think we're Aston Villa. They're I don't mean us. I mean no, the players. I know. I'm with you. With the, you. the mentality. Like, we went. We went out thinking we're Fulham were bigger, better than us. It's not even. No, no. It's not even. We're trying to respect it. Yeah, okay. It's no, the yeah, fact that no we just sat back thinking, so long as we keep possession, keep control of the ball, we can control the game. They got that one huge attack, and that was it. When, I think Hutton cares. As soon as we, as yeah. soon as we can see that, we can try and think, I think oh, he's just got pride. Yeah, yeah. He doesn't want to get mugged off by saying, you know, he'll try hard. No, Grealish. I love Grealish. He didn't turn up though. He didn't turn up today. Two of the German in the game. And it's the same thing, look. Years and years ago, you had Matt Letizia. Play for Southampton. So yeah. Move. Yeah. He didn't want to move. Could have went to Chelsea. Could have went. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He knew where his heart was. Okay, lads. Right. Can I ask you the question on, now? Man. Right. <laughs> to me, this is a fundamental question. Go on. For Aston Villa as a football club going forward, do we keep Steve no. Bruce or do we no. get rid yes. of him? No. Yes. Uh, no. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. yes. No. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you why I say no. Then you go. I like Bruce, and I and I know he cares, and I know he's he's just negative. He's, he reminds me of a Pulis or an Allardyce. It's like fight behind the ball and so we need to. I don't want to pay more money to watch us no, no, defend at home. No, you know what? I don't want to watch that shite. I want us to try, and I'd rather lose and try. It's not, it's not like he's a Pulis or Allardyce. It's like he's a Mourinho. He goes to a, if he's a Mourinho, he's a, Marino, no, no, no. a poor Mourinho. Yeah, he goes to a Mourinho sort of level in terms of like, you know, sitting back, control the game, try and play out from the back. Yeah, that's fine. But at the same time, when it gets your results, that's all right. But now, when it comes to this sort of level and this sort of stage, it doesn't get your results. Right. Mourinho has proved that this season. When he's, if, you, if you place Man City versus Man U this season, Mourinho defensive football, and Man City right. offensive football, I, I no. totally get what you're saying, you but you know, like when you pay him money to go and watch him, and you take his, I got my yeah. son, I take him to watch. Like, yeah. imagine if you're a Man U fan then, and you yeah. spend and you 200 get, million, you got yeah. Pogba and everyone else, and they still defend at home. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That I'm paying to watch you defend that, against that fucking what, shit is, teams. That is what we are this season. But I don't. You know, like Aston Villa yeah, football know, club it. shouldn't be like that. I we shouldn't it. be defending at home against it. Cardiff. At the same time, sometimes it breaks you know, my heart, mate. I used to watch okay. the Villa, I don't know. Yeah, so, uh, uh, if you say you get rid of Bruce, who are you going to get? Exactly. Who are you going to replace him? Who are you going to replace him with? Someone that loves Villa. Who? 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 Who's available to replace him? Yeah. Hey, right. Who's going to be on the spot there? Who's, yeah, no, who's no, available no. to replace him? Anyone who's young and positive. David Moyes and Allardyce. All right, and so why? Allardyce every day. I don't know. No, 
I do like it. Some. I don't some. like yes. it. I don't like it. I'll take Alibaba. It depends how you look at it. I don't like it. I'll take Alibaba. Or you could, I don't know, it would get us promoted. You know, yeah. And yeah. that would be enough. No, no. You know but what? the long term, I wouldn't want Alibaba. Nice well, like everyone, say, everyone says the same thing. Who would you have? Who's going to get Alibaba? I don't know what's happened, don't you? Every fucking choice. Over the years, Villa haven't looked after their players and put them in coaching roles. You know, like. Say like, yeah, like guy, man, he's Middlesbrough. Safe guy should have managed Villa. He should never have left Villa. But we didn't look after him. No, I, I, I could name another ten players that we've let go somewhere else. You know, Nigel Spink, you know, you know, Spink is Blues goalkeeping coach. Who the fuck is Nigel Spink coaching Blues? He won the European Cup for us, but he's coaching Blues now. What's that about? Look, you know what? Heartbreaking shit. I was gonna say like, who the fuck's gonna take over from Bruce if he doesn't if he doesn't like carry on? Mark Delaney. You see what Delaney's doing with the twenty threes? Have you seen what he's doing with the twenty threes? Have you seen what he's done with the other twenty threes? Different job though, isn't it? When it's real pressure and you're really going. Today it was a 300 million pound match. Yeah, exactly. It's big and we had one shot on target. That sums up the mentality. You with me, bro? They had 10 men, 10 men for 25 minutes, and we still only had one shot. The mentality is shit. It's shit. It's shit. We say to ourselves now, like, you should be. If you have one shot on target against some man, be embarrassed of yourself. Be embarrassed of yourself. Am I right or wrong? (laughs) 25 minutes against 10 men, and we had one shot on target. So, to me, that's Steve Bruce's fault. It's no one else's fault, it's he the manager's it, fault. Because I would have gone, I'm not a manager, but I'd have gone two wingers, two strikers, attacking midfielder, let's put it on them. Instead, we play sorry bro, we're playing little one twos around the fucking defence with 20 minutes to go. Bollocks, bollocks mate. Spending my money on these fuckers. Breaks me heart, mate. Breaks your heart. Just try. If we'd have lost today and hit the bar in the post, a few shots wide, I'd have gone here, I'd have tried it. We, we tried, we got done. To we didn't try. Yeah. All we I wanted didn't was try. to celebrate a goal. We didn't try. A goal to celebrate. That yeah. would have been perfect. Yes. But we had nothing. Nothing. Nothing to celebrate. No, no to say. I'm not bothered that, bother that we lost. I am bothered that we lost. But it's the way you lose. It's the way you lose. Just wiped out. Yeah. Just done. Yeah. Me and you had a fight now, and we had loads of punches, and you knocked me out. I'd go, good fight that. Yeah. But if I just walked and you knocked me out, I'd go, oh. You you know know what? What? That was the thing. We were just faggots, that's what we was, Villa. It was just like we turned up just to show up. No. Heartbreaking. Like, like Heartbreaking. Paying my money to watch them fucking. No attacking in 10 hours, just like. Sorry, to you. No. No, 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 no. I've been a Villa fan since I was fucking no. eight years of age, mate. No, no, I ain't missed the game. Right, it's fucking hard, man. Of course we are. Of course we are. It means something to me. I know it don't mean nothing to them cunts, though. Does it not? Which player would you say really, really meant it today? Which one would you go? I love him, he tried his best. I love him all, but which one would you go? He put his fucking face. Yeah. Who else? Hutton. I'm not saying he played well, but I know we care. He cares a lot. He's just the others just turn up, mate, for the way. Turn up for the way. You know what I would say as well? Well, let's listen to your opinion. Let me film you. Go on. No, 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 no. You tell me what you think. Question. I'm videoing you. I would say them Villa players was under instructions to play a certain way. Yeah, defensively and negatively. They yeah, were told, man. We they were Villa. told. We're playing against Fulham. As soon as we conceded, still carried on playing it around the back. Didn't try and like make any sort of attack. Like there was no there was no Snoddy like, and Snoddy and Donut. They weren't trying to make those burst and runs past the left and right back. They were just kind of like holding back. See if anyone was going for the overlap. There's no point. There was, there was no, just all playing there was around no the back. desire and. Yeah. Courage, do you know like, I've, I've played football all my life, do you know like, sometimes you're one on one with a full back, the easy option is to just pass the ball. Yeah, right. Someone like who's got balls record. like Kodja would try a trick. Not one of our players was willing was, to try a trick or to was, do something different. That, it was was the just game, that was the game changer for us. So that was effortless. The game, that was the game changer. Adoma, oh sorry not Adoma, uh, Onoma and Kodja coming back up. Yeah. That is when we started looking dangerous. To be honest, Onuma man, started making making waves. Onuma, Kodja, I think Onuma was shit, but Kodja, he, he could be quality. He just don't care enough. Nah, I don't. I don't think he's there. I don't think Onuma cares enough. I agree. I think nah, that was I agree. laziest fucking. I nah. think we should have. Had I think on. probably seven of our players don't really care. Nah. It's just a wage and a job. That's it. Look, you got to say. Freelish Hutton, 
Terry's Terry, 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 gonna leave now. Only because Terry's got pride in himself. Yeah, nah, that's it. I like him, but nah. he's just gonna leave now. So I want to put a fan page on Facebook, you? and oh. someone said to me, uh, someone yeah, wrote, yeah. Uh, if if we go up, John Terry will go down as a Villa legend. <laughs> Do you know what? <laughs> All I put back was Paul McGrath's a Villa legend. John Terry's a Chelsea legend, yeah. and we'll leave it there. That's all you got to say. Villa legend. We yeah, finished fourth. In... Gordon Cairns, is he not? Yes, he's a legend. Yeah. We finished fourth in the championship, and he wants legend status. Like fucking idiot. Pathetic. Pathetic. Breaks my heart, mate. Yeah. I've been watching these shitters since yeah. David Sutton. Yeah. 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 I'm not saying I'm the only one. No, 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 what I mean is, no, no, right, no, we're, no, right, we're Aston Villa, yeah? Okay. I don't need to say what we've won because we all know. We've won it all. We've got a stadium that's big as fuck. We've got everything. And we're that's scared fuck. of Fulham that are like. Mohamed Al Fayed put Michael Jackson's it's fucking statue, statue up. And they took, statue. Uh, that sums up the, the level of clubs. And we're going there respecting them. We go we're we go like we're the 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 regular, sorry. bollocks. And, and we spent, we probably spent 40 million this pre-season. Fulham have spent nothing. So let's look, you know, it's embarrassing. No, That's no, the of football no, club, the man. No wonder the Blues fans chat all the shit they chat. Because we're an embarrassment to The way I see it, we haven't respected them. We just haven't respected ourselves. No, we went into that game, yeah, that's it. like Stoke playing Spurs, it's like yeah, yeah. we're going into it thinking they've got good players so we'll defend, we defend, defend, defend and hope we get a little touch on the way back. No, we're Villa so we go there, we smash them and if we that. lose, lose him a bit of fucking heart. You know we what? lost with no heart no, today, no, we no, just no. lost and it's yeah, a shit no, way to lose. You know what, I, think, I don't think we started off with a defensive mentality. I thought we, oh, just, kind of, we just kind of like held the ball around and think like, as long as we play it around a little bit, you know, take control of the game. Can anyone we'll get the stats right? up? Let's see how many shots, possession. I just want to know because, you know, when you're half drunk and you're watching the game, I just remember in the first half, I can't remember a shot from Villa. I can't remember possession. We were just like turned up to watch them play. It's fucking goal, heartbreaking goal, 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 goal. to me, like, half, it's my club. Fair enough, we're in there half all the time. Second half, we tried, I'll oh, give them that. What but not enough. We tried, but not enough. Yeah. The tactics the are shit. Don't tell it. Go on then. We had 49% possession, they had 51. Shots Over the whole goal. game? Yeah. Shots um, on goal? Shots on goal, we had 12, they had 15. We had two on target. Two on target. We had three. Two. Yeah. Right. Do you know the two on target? Tell it'll be a little trickle where he picks it up. Yeah, exactly. Tell it, right? I'd have loved to have seen their keeper give it the big fucking top corner save. Or hit the bar or the post or summit. It's just bollocks, mate. Yeah. Bollocks, yeah. mate. Yeah. Any excitement would have been good. Any excitement would have been worth it. It was just fucking bullshit. Yeah. Oh, I love it. Made all that money. Did all that. It's just third time I've been to Emily Days. Oh, I've only ever missed one Wembley. No, I've been before. Like, yeah. I've obviously the ship the nine goals though. I did go to Liverpool semi final, uh, but that's the only one. I, I went to the final. I went to Arsenal final. I went to Chelsea semi final. Yes. Hey, hey shots hey, on target. Hey, hey, hey. It's Arsenal zero, zero. So the last two times that I've travelled and spent my money, we've had two shots. Two shots I, I in 118 minutes. I, 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 the mentality is weak. Weak. A person I've seen. You can see nine goals. You just hit the nail on the head. <laughs> Look at you hit the nail on the head. Two yeah. big matches three and we've had two shots three on target. Three three Look, did you get the stats up then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. And I bet you out of them two shots, one of them was just a trickle. Yeah, yeah but no, yeah, it was. Probably both of them was. Yeah, it was definitely one trickle. I didn't see a good save from there. One out of two. So we've been here. Did you go the last one, Arsenal? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. No shots on target. No, we didn't yeah, even have a shot, I don't think. Did Never mind on target. Didn't expect anything. You know? So we've, we've all spent all this money anything, and all this man. fucking hope and fucking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we've seen two shots. It, nah, two shots. We went to Liverpool. We, we beat Liverpool. That was and that was a surprise. Oh, 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 we went to Arsenal not expecting anything. And I was fine with losing. I was okay with it. It's the way you lose, like your man said. It's the way that you lose that matters. You know, like. Arsenal was always going to beat us, always. Yeah, they're going to wipe us out. But, but at least... We got that. At least go like long ball on them or something, just try something. Yeah. Instead of just going, oh, they're better than us, so we'll just sit back and let them smash us. No, try something. I'd rather get smashed and try to win. Yeah. But today, we've been done. We haven't really tried. 
Second half. Would you we say were really? Second half. Talk? First half was shit. Mucca. We had 25 to 30 minutes against 10 men. And we still had one shot. One shot against 10 men. Come on now. Ashton Villa Football Club. At the end of the day. We did not deserve to go out this season. We don't. No, you're right. And there's, there's no point arguing about like. No, I was right. I was coming into this thing. You're right there. Jesus. I was coming in, I was coming into this thing. Look, 50-50, It's gonna be win all or lose all. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. fair enough. Like I can't expect us to win. We didn't win. Fair enough. We don't deserve it. If we deserve it, we're going to top two next it's season. Sad but we won't. It's sad that we it's don't sad deserve it. It's sad that Villa are getting to this stage right now. You know deserve. what's even more sad? That we spent more than the team. Gone up. Yeah. We spent more than all of them. No, you know what the thing is now. And we fourth, fourth. We've had. And people are saying John Terry's a Villa legend. We finished fourth out of twenty-four look, shit teams. Look, the issue that we've got. Let's be now, honest now. Who's yeah. the best striker in the championship? Tell me that. I beg you, tell me that. Uh, You're struggling. You tell me that. Striker. There's some belong there. He's sick. How good was he? How good was he though? Some belong there. Central. Is it? Mitrovic probably the best in the league. Yeah. Mitrovic That's is. That's how shit the league is. No, Mitrovic yeah, yeah, yeah. is. And we're thinking of John Terry. And we're thinking of John Terry like he's had a great season. He's marked no one. Who was he marked that's good? Put, put Aguero against uh, John Terry. He'll absolutely yeah. tear him a new yeah. asshole. Obviously, he's yeah. played against no one for 20 fucking 30 for whatever games for nothing. Look, He deserves no credit from yeah. me. The issue that we've got right now is we've just had two seasons down. You get 40 million for the first two seasons to get relegated for your parachute payments from when you get relegated. Yeah. So we've had those two parachute payments. Yeah. Now what have we got? Nothing. We don't deserve anything. Do we don't deserve, what, we do don't deserve to, to keep our heads above water. Do you know what, though, my mocker? I know you know your villa and that. We have had 20 years of setting up a youth system and a reserve system. Yeah, we yeah, shouldn't yeah. be struggling. We should have players should coming through. That's why I'm saying. We're in a city. That's why I'm we're saying. Two, but, nearly two million people. How can we get a player every year? And that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. What player we need every you year? Have you seen players that were given 20 Come on. Them poor kids that are growing up in Birmingham. And we're buying shit grabbing. I'm not saying he's shit, but he's a 32 year old low knee from Bournemouth. We're loading players from Bournemouth. That is the end. We are, we are getting players that can't get in the Bournemouth team. We're Aston Villa. And that is all I need to say on the matter. We're loading Bournemouth subs. Don't you dare look at his name here. Gabby served as well, didn't he? Gabby. Gabby only cared until he got rich. As soon as he got money, he didn't care. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. I, I'm mates with Chris Murray's brother. I like Gabby as a person, but I'll tell you, he does not care about Villa. But if you did, you would train and you would work hard well, and you would kiss that run. badge. And then when that went, he had, he had nothing. Don't give a fuck, mate. He gets, yeah, his, he exactly. gets his 60 grand and he's happy to go home. Yeah. Fuck off. I ain't bothered about them cunts. <laughs> Put your fucking. I like spend my money on my son to come to Villa. You know, like, and me oh, to go know. season tickets and travelling, and then you go there and they don't even try. Yeah, yeah. They don't even try. It's your money, that is hard earned. Yeah. Yeah. I, I love the cunts. I've been going here since I was six. Me, you're working you all earn our money, mate. mate. We all earn our money. What I mean is, I'd rather spend it on the cinema or bowling. You know what I mean? I'm spending it and they're not even trying. They're not even trying. How many players can you say trot, like really put their all Try into it Alan today? Alan, 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 every Alan, time. Alan, every time. Every time. Every time. And you know why? Not because he loves Villa, because he, he's got pride in himself. It's in his DNA. It's in his, it's in his DNA. DNA. So if I said to you, me and you would have a game of tennis. I would try my fucking you know, best, mate. You know why? Because I got pride in myself. You could be the, you could be Andre Agassi, but I'm still trying my best. But you got cunt turning up and not trying. That's what fucking kills me. We've lost to a worse team, really. We've actually lost to a worse team. You know what? No, we ain't lost to a worse team. No better team than us. Not because they've got better players than us, but because they've got a better team spirit and they know how to play better as a team. We did not set ourselves up to play a proper game of football today. We didn't we didn't deserve to we didn't deserve to, you know, play an attacking game. See. Because we always set up a classic like nice big four, sit back, button, elbow. So what you're really saying is they haven't got a better team, but they've got a better mentality. No, they're going there to win. 
Fulham have gone there to go up into the Fulham Premier League. Fulham We've gone there to hold Fulham down for half and try and nick one. And then we'll go. And then defend no, and then we'll go. bollocks. Literally, all I'm saying is... Oh, I love your opinion. I'm not locking your opinion. I'm yeah, just I'm, saying I'm the mentality of Aston Villa is heartbreaking. We haven't got a better team. We, we have. have got a better team. We have. That's literally We've got like... So we've got John Terry. We've got Alan Hutton. Alan Hutton was bought for eight million. John Terry was England captain. Then we've got Kodja. We spent like 12 million for Kodja. He was the best player in the championship when we bought him. No, when we bought him. Kodja, no, I think it's, I think Kodja has been given a bad rap this season. Purely because... He's only no, played. Yeah, before his injury, well, not well. Last year, Kodja was the best player. Yeah, yeah, before, before, yeah, before his injury. He's the most important player got. Yeah, before his injury. I think Jack is, but I think he's close second. Yeah. Before his injury, Kodja... Absolutely class. After his injury, he hasn't got. He hasn't. Bruce just forgot about it. Yeah, he hasn't got back into his form. Bruce forgot about yeah, it. He brought gravity. You're right about that. He brought gravity purely to make sure that you know we've got some sort of focal point in attack. That's it. Then when Kodja comes back in, he hasn't been given a game time that he deserves because of, because of like his injury. Like fair enough, Graben. He had a he had a decent enough spell like for us. You know, scored, bagged a couple of goals, but at the same time, Kodja. Right. Everyone's been giving Kodja a bad rap and he doesn't deserve it this season. No, he's been I, like, listen, I'm not knocking Kodja. The point I'm making, in fact, I'm bigging up Kodja. The point I'm making is you've got like John Terry, he's an ex England captain. Chester is Premier League standard. Hutton is the bollocks for me. Yeah. I'd put Hutton against most other players, right? And then you've got Yedina. He's a, supposed to be a Premier League central. No, no, no. I'm not saying I think he is. What I'm saying is. And then you've got Grealish, who could probably play for England. Yeah. Some point, if you some put point. Grealish around good players, he would change. So, so, so then, all I'm saying to you is, tell me Fulham players that are good besides Sessignon. What? That's it. Yeah, and that, yeah. that's what I'm saying. And how good is Mitch, Mitch then? He's, he is class. He deserves, class. He deserves to be When you say player. class, how do you define class? As in, he bullies the... He, he absolutely... Dominate. So why, if I look at his stats now, he's played a hundred games for Newcastle, he's scored twelve goals. Look at his stats this season for Fulham, and look what he's done so far. He's done for Fulham. What I'm saying is, if you're John Terry, you should manage Mitrovic like there's nothing, because you're playing against fucking Ronaldo. Messi, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cristiano, you know, that's Mitrovic. The that's the thing. He kept, Mitrovic, no, he kept, stand up and mark no, the gun. No, no, that's the thing. He kept him quiet. He kept Mitrovic quiet today. He kept Cessna quiet. I'll keep him quiet. No, no, he He's shit. No, no, that's not Can't get in the Newcastle team. Joy Gale couldn't get in the Crystal Palace team. And he's yeah, in the... Yeah, come yeah, on yeah. now. So we're saying Joy Gale's better than Mitrovic. Joy Gale's yeah. shit. Yeah, he scores six Gale. goals in 40 games. So that's how bad Mitrovic is. Come on, we're Aston Villa Football Club. How high are we aiming? How high are we? Are we shit or are we good now? I, I used to watch us playing against Atletico Madrid and beating them, Inter Milan, beating them. Man United you know, didn't want to come to Villa Park. No, no, we're like a laughing stock. Even yeah. Fulham, we're even respecting Fulham that much that we're defending against yeah. them. You know what? How heartbreaking. You know what I'm saying? It fucking breaks my heart. We're not respecting Fulham, we're disrespecting ourselves. That's a great, great, great shout, son. Great we're shout. Not, we're not saying to Fulham, yeah, yeah, please come on to us. We're just That's saying, a great shout. We're just saying... We're saying that's been Villa. We're not willing to play attacking football. We're not willing to play the game and press the game like it deserves to be played. Comfortable to attack. Exactly. Stella. Yeah. Right, Alright, bud. Bex. Bex. Right then. So, where do we put Villa now as a club? We're not arguing, we're talking football. Yeah, we're so, not, we're not a so a Newcastle yeah. is a bigger club than Villa now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, absolutely. okay. Uh, Difficult, isn't it? A Bournemouth a bigger club than Villa? Why not? not? We've got a bigger fan base. You can't got... just value recent form, can you? Look, I not... agree, but I want to know where we are now. We're gonna, it's, I don't it's mean in the league. I mean yeah, as a as status, as a it's club. Like, it's what like, are we? So like like you world, 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 we're right? loaning Brexit players Brexit. from Bournemouth. <laughs> we have got players that can't get in the Bournemouth team. You've got to go in the head. Bournemouth are in the Prem. We're not. A Burnley bigger than Villa now? No. Why not? Why not? No one knows who Burnley are. People still know Villa. When up. you say no one, but and I'm not like no, in our I want to know your outside of our country. Like, no, we, uh, I bet mean, they do now. I mean, your your no. reputation in the world's ranking has to be related. No, you know what I think? I swear to God, I swear to God, I think as Villa fans, we think that we're a big club to the world because yeah. we won the European yeah. Cup in '82. Nobody knows 
For, for you know, if you walked in Spain or yeah, Italy and yeah, met a 20 year old and went, that's the middle of the European, they'd laugh at you. Yeah. They'd laugh at you. Nobody cares about that. Can I, we care because we're Villa fans. Can I, yeah. can, can, I, can, big man. can I stop you there, yeah? You mentioned about winning the European Cup, yeah? Today at Wembley, yeah? My name's Danny Brown, yeah? I know you are, big man. Yeah, there was three generations of my family there. Me, my son, and my grandson, yes. yeah? If, you, if I was to say to them, that's Gary Shaw, that's Tony Morley, they would not They would not mean Jack Diddley to them. You couldn't even say, nothing. sorry to interrupt you, big man, you couldn't even say to them, that's David Platt. Yeah. No one cares about yeah. 82 no more. We I, do, because we, we brought up on it. Yeah. No, I, no, 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 I, no, no, no. you at the moment. If you, sorry, Dan. Yeah. If someone no, no, was gonna, no, no, no. if you was no, a player no, no, no. and someone was gonna sign, yeah, you signed for Burnley before Villa. Yeah. Well, yeah, no, 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 that's because, yeah, that's, that's, that's because, because that's because, Prem that's because. That's because yeah, okay. European, like, as in the old, the old man, you know, you've got European Cup winning side, and the old Liverpool European Cup winning side. They're more those names because they was, you know, on telly and whatnot. The Villa wasn't at the time. Yeah, eighty-two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 We've got it in our. You're right. What you're saying. The forest. Every every faction and the forest. No one gives you. Yeah. And do you know the truth? The forest and the villa. No but, one gives a know, shit that forest. Don't, don't, yeah, no. Do you know like if you spoke to a 20 year old or a 25 year old, no one cares that forest yeah. won it in 81. Everybody knows fucking Man United. Yeah, because they was alive then. Yeah. You know, like once your generation dies out, no one gives a shit. Agreed. 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 It's sad, but it's true. Forest were to That is the reality. I say to my son. I say to my son. Right, we're, we're 24, 25. I'm 35. My son is eight, yeah, and I go to him. You know, the Champions League, we won that. And he goes, uh, <laughs> did Grealish play? <laughs> I say, no, nah, Grealish weren't born. Nah, you know yeah. what? Like, you don't no, care? No, 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 Why no, would no, he care? We grew, up, we grew up around the time. So, so the last time I seen my club yeah. that I put my whole life into win a trophy was 1996. Look, I'm fucking 35 now. <laughs> You know what? The last like, the last like, <laughs> yeah, 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 I know you, put me all life into him. So like, like me, and Toby, me and Toby are like 24, 25. Now. Yeah. So you like, never seen us win a trophy then? No, yeah, no, that's when bad. We, no, that's but when, bad. no, no, when we were growing up, it was the time around about like between like 2005, 2010. That was when. Martin O'Neill years. I don't know Martin when, O'Neill. Yeah, when we finished six yeah. years yeah. in the world. Martin O'Neill. That was when we Martin knew. O'Neill wanted us to be big. Yeah, that was when we were on the cusp of O'Neill something good. Like but at the same time, yeah. but only, no, it wasn't O'Neill part of it. O'Neill's wife, I think it was O'Neill's wife got cancer or something, so we had to quit Villa. And no, had to go. No. Yeah, and that is that, true. And then as soon as, as soon as that, as soon as you the went. The truth is, you know when you meet a bird? Do you know when you meet a new girl and you've got a few quid? And you take it to Nando's and you take it to the chop. Honestly, that is all. But, uh, what was the American whose name that owned that? That's all he done. He turned up, splashed a few quid, so we thought, oh, he's, he's a cool guy, yeah. And then he thought, fuck you, like. That's all he was. So when O'Neill says, I need to buy so and so, he said, listen, you bad what you. I, I said you'd have. No, he didn't was, give a fuck O'Neill about that. O'Neill was back in the days when it was fucking. Um, what's his name? Before Lana. Ah, old bastard. Doug Ellis. Doug Ellis. Yeah. Well, before you go any further, Doug Ellis is the only reason we're still going yeah. as a yeah. club. Doug That's Ellis. the only reason we're still a club. Yeah, because he Thank never you. overspent and he never gives people too much money. It he knew how to, to manage. manage. Listen, when Doug Ellis was chairman, we finished top 10 every season. Yeah. That's all I wanted. It's realistic. No, we fucked. We're in the fucking championship, losing to Fulham and turning up like we're fucking Stoke City. Look, the thing is, like, we can't look at this season. Stoke City, we are now. We are like Stoke City. Yeah, we are. We can't look at this season saying like, oh, we've lost, the, we've lost the Fulham and that's the end of our season. Our story of our season is the fact that we have finished fourth and we haven't finished top. What? Do you think that's good? No, no, that's what I'm saying. Our story of the season shouldn't be looked at like. Oh yeah, we lost to Fulham in the playoff final. Oh no, what a shit season. We gotta look at the thing and think. Do you know we what? haven't finished in the top two. That is our problem. Like you know, we can't say like any of this season is a success. I, listen, I respect every Villa fan's opinion. If you pay your money, you go to the game. Yeah. I don't know more than you. But I'll tell you what, my opinion is this, yeah. If Cardiff can start the season with 12 full-time professionals and go up and we can't, then something has gone wrong in our camp. They turned up. All they had was what's his name who come from fucking QPR. Oiler. Oiler. That's the only player they had. Yeah. They only had one player all season. They've gone up. They've um, 
How much do you get when you go? 200 million, 300 million? We've spent fucking 40 million. Any kids, I'm sorry for swearing. We spent 40 million and we still ain't gone up. Your man had 11 players. And now it's going to be even harder because Stoke have gone down, West Brom have gone down. It was over at Swansea. They're all better than us. We've lost our. We've, we've had our two parachute payments for the last two seasons. We need, we're going to sink. We are going to sink. We're going to do a couple you know of I will support these pricks, elite. even if we're in the conference. Yeah, so yeah, it's yeah, in my exactly. blood. It's in my blood. But, but, you know, like, you just want them to try. Look, All I, I wanted to see them not really want it. At the moment, we're doing a lead. But if we're not fucking careful, we're going to do a fucking bolt. We're going to have to have a fucking lead one. Yeah, that's, that's what I was going to say next. We were going to do a lead. Yeah. Uh, no, Leeds. No, yeah. no, no, Leeds. No, but Leeds, Leeds, no, but Leeds are exactly, I would probably say, Leeds yeah. are exactly the same size club as we yeah, are. No, Leeds, no, no, Leeds, no, Leeds are a big, Leeds massive Leeds club, mate. But the difference with Leeds, and you know what, I'll give Leeds credit, because they tried to win, get it. they had Bowyer and Keane and yeah. Fowler and Rio Fert, they tried. We yeah, never tried. Yeah. Can we still shit? The thing never is, really tried. We've proven this season that we you can shit. have as many big players as you want. You can have your fucking Terry's <laughs> chest, <laughs> the Dovers, any stock prices, big, apparently Premier League players. They're not going to get anywhere. It's not about really the fucking mate. No, they the were. A do, a do, a a do were in his prime. It's Premier League player. It's not grass in his prime. Big Premier League player. Terry in his prime. Big Premier We've all got names. We've got names. And that means Look at the walls. We've got nothing. Okay, let's let's fly back then. Look at the walls of case. No, no, it's time. No, 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 it's time. Let's say that one. It's time. Let the man, let the man speak. Let the man speak. It's time last season. Let him go. Let him go. Let him go. The walls manager. Here we go. Another, another fucking. Nobody, nobody knows. He's on the ramp. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're going to make this. Pops us next step to links to agents. That's why they got the letter, at least to agents. That is literally it for what Wolves have done. What, this imagine? Oh, it's it's purely been about the fucking super agent they've got. How the fuck are you going to get Ivan Cavalero, Ruben Nevers, Diego Yotta? How are you going to get them in the championship playing great? Okay, okay, I get your point. I'm with you on that one. But you know what? It's a case study. You know what I mean? It's a case of it. how you fucking manage to turn players that don't deserve to be in the championship. Okay, then. Into the okay, championship. Then. So, we're Aston Villa Football Club, yeah? That means nothing, though. It, it does nothing. To me, it does. Yeah, to me, it does as well. But to everyone else, to me, it means as we've proven today, it means nothing. To me. As we've proven what today, What I'm saying to you is this, right? Steve Bruce gets to choose who he wants to sign. See that? I should play for him. What? So, get him in there. Get me in there. So, sorry, 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 sorry,